How's it going everyone? I'm Contemption. This is Contemption Gaming. We took down the ruined Crusader Fortress and this video is the do's and don'ts on how to get it done. Check it out! Alright, so I recorded this yesterday. We already took it down. Uh, we got Khan here running the rally. He's going to run Khan and Tao Tao. Great combination for this kind of PvE. Uh, right behind him, we got Ganja. Hey, Ganja. How's it going, man? Um, so you're going to see what to do and what not to do. We did a little bit of both on this video. Uh, some stuff we shouldn't have done, but you're always going to have a, a crowd control problem, especially when people try and reinforce the rally from opposite sides of the leg the rally's on which is something you don't want to do. So you'll see the um, markers here on what to do and what not to do. Uh, you don't want to swarm the Rune Crusader Fortress. Even at the end, it's not suggested. You'll see we do it. Don't do it. You want to keep the area of effect, which is the AOE, completely clear. You'll see people in this area, and it's, it's a no-no. Uh, we'll just watch what happens when the Rune Crusader Fortress starts casting his area of effect skill. It's huge. <clears throat> it does a lot of damage. And the, the biggest downfall is, is that if it defeats, yeah, see there's the AOE, it hits everybody in a giant circle. So everybody needs to stand back in the leg. And I'll show you why there's people in the legs heading towards the Rune Crusader Fortress in a second. But uh, you'll see that Anytime a troop dies in the field from the AOE, the Room Crusader Fortress heals a lot. So if you get a bunch of marches that are in that area that die, it's going to heal. And you're going to have to keep hitting it, keep hitting it. And then there's a maximum where it gets to a certain point. It does way too much damage. The rally dies. So you see the spawns. Those need to be taken down right away. I'm surprised nobody jumped on it right away. Uh, typically, you kind of want to pull them back down into the leg so everyone can swarm them, swarm them, and you're not in the AOE of the Rune Crusader Fortress. You got to take them out quickly because when they're spawned, the damage the Rune Crusader Fortress takes is reduced by a significant amount. So you really want to take those down quickly, and then everybody needs to get out because you'll see in a second that the Rune Crusader Fortress is going to heal because it's going to take out a few marches. So thankfully we got it the first time we did it, but it could have been done faster. You'll see banners pop up of other kingdoms who captured their Rune Crusader Fortress before us. And that's just because we let it heal too many times. Uh, so let's just take a look. So we're not even halfway down, but see, look at that. It healed by 70,000 troops just for taking out that march. And hopefully we don't get any more popping up here. But I know at the end there, there was, uh, there was quite a few. I'll just uh, pop up some images while we're waiting for this thing to go down and a couple more things to happen. Um, you'll see how many troops are in here. There's a screenshot of that. And then this next photo is going to be of the what's inside the Rune Crusader Fortress. When you capture it, the rewards you get. So here's that. Okay, and now we're... Still going, we're just under halfway. Now you'll see this guy reinforcing from all the way across the Rune Crusader Fortress on the other leg. Definitely not a good idea because I'm pretty sure that this one, and I don't know why there's so few troops, dies and goes back and heals the Rune Crusader Fortress. Maybe it was a troll. I don't know, 29,000 troops in a full march seems really odd, but it is what it is. Uh, you'll see those spawns come up again. You got to take them out right away. More people reinforcing from across the, the map here, which isn't good. Um, you should always go to the other leg. That's why there's so many marches there. They're probably just people waiting to get in. So people reinforcing from across just does not help. So hopefully we take that down quickly. And I think in a second here, you're going to see people start swarming it. I guess they get a little impatient and um, just go at it. Not suggested, just let the rally from start to end of the Rune Crusader Fortress. It just makes way more sense. There's yeah more people healing it now. 
you just don't want that opportunity, especially when you're at the very end. And then all of a sudden you let it heal. You're going to run out of time because that, that skill is going to come up and it's just brutal. Yeah. Here comes the swarms right when you have it on a mark or two. Don't swarm. <laughs> oh man. Yeah. And Aloha too. Like some people swarming with just, just the wrong marshes and gone healed it. Not good. And then all of a sudden you get everybody coming in. It was not the uh, best shot. <laughs> and you'll, yeah, you'll see, I'm probably going to blank out the chat. I can see it, but I probably, I'm going to blank it out for everybody else. But yeah, you can imagine what's being said. But it's pretty much done. Thankfully, we get it. But you can see how many people on the AOE. Look at the damage that's going to come out of this thing. It's just going to be a sea of red. Look at that. Like you can almost instantly heal the whole thing if that was already injured troops or marches. It was so close. Thankfully, people are, are uh, taking down the swarms. And there you go. We got it. So the, the do's and don'ts. But uh, thanks for joining me, everybody. I hope you tune into the next episode. Um, don't do it like that, but uh, I'm still good. <laughs>